Let's talk about one of the sad realities of New York City real estate, and that's evictions. And I'll explain why it was really important to me to incorporate eviction history into Open Igloo so prospective renters can get a sense for how active their landlords are in eviction court with their tenants. Usually when people hear about evictions, they think, oh, it's because someone stopped paying rent or you know, because they broke the terms of the lease and they deserve to be evicted. Some cases are like that and we sort of label them in the policy world as being good cause evictions, but there's a whole other category and slew of evictions that happen in New York. And this headline kind of captures one of those instances where a landlord is currently in the process of evicting 30% of their building for a whole slew of reasons. Usually non-payment is one of them. But the important thing to note is why are these tenants not paying? They're not paying because there is a slew of maintenance issues that just haven't been addressed. And I don't know about you, but if my building didn't have essential services, heat, water, pest management, whatever it is, I wouldn't be paying rent either. I'm not saying that all landlords abuse housing court to systemically evict tenants from their building so they can jack rents, but some landlords do. And that's why we include this stat on every single building and owner profile on Open Igloo, so you can see how many evictions are associated with that landlord and how it measures compared to the rest of the city. So yeah, a 100 unit building that's had one eviction in the past 10 years, not crazy but a 100 unit building that's had 20 evictions in the past few years, that should raise a red flag to you that you should not be supporting that landlord nor renting apartments from them. So yes, while it's important to find an apartment that's in your budget, that's in the right location, it's also important to make sure that the landlord that you're putting money into their pocket isn't responsible for displacing longtime New Yorkers from that neighborhood. And you can do so by checking open igloo and just doing a little bit more digging into who they are.